Wait for it. Give me a moment. I'm not being a fool for it twice. Damn thing. Damn game. <clears throat> fool me once. Are you gonna fool me twice? Anyway. Hi everybody, Prototype Jim here and welcome to April 24th. We are back. We are playing this game. I played the demo previously on the channel. But now the actual game has come out. It is out. So we're gonna give it a go. I hope there's some differences into the main story. Well, differences to the demo. I do wonder. Or will the demo be the beginning bit? Well we'll just jump in and see. Let's get us scare on. So it is sort of different. I pick up the axe. Such random. I mean, the story was that you're like a a journalist. This is where we come. Went down at the end of the demo. You're an experienced journalist that snaked into a. Oh my god, so many noises. Is that upstairs? Oh my god, so much movement. It's giving me goosebumps already. Hello? Oh! Jesus Christ! Already? I was expecting something but not like that. Can I open this door? Am I stuck in here? Straight off the bat as well. It's the same, you're an experienced journalist investigating a house. Oh, that's the clock, is it? I hope it's the clock. Uh sir, what are you doing with that? Sir? Are you alive? Are you an actual person? Shouldn't have done that in your bed. She deserved to be punished. You've been living in the basement for months and haven't come out. You're going crazy and dragging us along. The kids and I don't understand what's going on with you. You become aggressive and you're, you're taking out all your anger on us. Alice is sick. It's hard for her to live in such an environment. And Jacob is still young and I don't want him to get hurt. Know what we have the right to leave without you. I try to discuss everything with you in a normal setting. But you don't make contact. I just want you to know that. All right. I read too slow, David. Wait, I have an axe now. So clearly he's. So much noises. It wasn't the camera, was it? It was normal last time, wasn't it? You? You're telling me to go up there. Can I hit you? Okay. Oh, 
Don't tell me we're going to commit the murder, are we? So I'm guessing the guy, his wife and kids have left. Ooh, the meatballs. Glass everywhere. Hmm. They're upstairs, are they? You take me out up there. Oh, we're gonna go up there and kill. I can't make sense of what you're saying. I'm guessing it's supposed to be like. I've messed up things in his head. Which room do I go in first? All the action is going through there, so probably end first. <laughs> Ooh, it's a floating axe. Too big. We try the other door first. Alright. Oh, fuck Jesus Christ. Let me go to that door. I old horses, man. I'm gonna look around. That's back. Oh, we're in here. I'm guessing this is the start. My name is Sean Mira. I conduct a journalist investigation on the brutal murder of the outskirts of the city that the occasion of that April, uh, occurred on April the 24th. I want to find out the truth. Too slow. Chapter three already. Well, uh. Do we have a light? Can we hit the switch? So we in the house now, or on April the twenty-fourth, brutal murder took place in a house on the outskirts of a city. A man killed his entire family with an axe. The accused, the accused himself, calling the police, <coughs> and was arrested on the spot. The man testified and says that he was influenced by a certain man in a hat 
and that it has forced him to commit this crime. The police have no further comments and will monitor, monitor development in the case. Yeah, so basically he's just trying to say he was possessed or some sort. Anything else? Am I locked in here? So some random noises. There's nothing else to do. So I can't just take that with me. I am so confused. <clears throat> Is there a light? <clears throat> am I missing something? Do I need to sit down? I like video game noises. Makes no sense to me. Look, I'm looking for a key. Oh, handprint. Pierce on me. Is this in the house? Ah. Whoa. I've got the door slamming. Ah, so this is a bit, a bit of a demo then. Hello, Mr. Teddy Bear. for a knife. It's a crazy baby guy. I don't know if it's supposed to uh of course. Absolute creepy face. So that's supposed to signify the uh kid. Voice to still send shivers down my arms, man. The demonic noises. We're free. 
I don't know why it's like Victorian pictures there though. It seems really weird. Don't like. So much formal noises. Ryan. Ew, what are you doing? What a freaking alive. Is that, is that like munching on intestines or something? I changed the painting now. This to be a woman like staring at you. Yep, I fell down. What the frick? Suddenly added new bits to it. Take that. Can't know what I'm expecting here, but still made me jump. Even though I knew it was coming. I changed it to a padlock instead of a... So much moving noises. Cross push out. Creepy ass woman. Hi. I should point down on that. Like a demo. You ain't gonna give me that one. Finally, that one coming. I got me the key. In front of the door there. Let's go. Again. Still looks like her hair's like round her neck on that picture. The clock's all quiet now. Freaking this. Now it's banging on the door. Singing again, oh my god. So eerie. So it makes me go this way. 
Like you can literally go in the end of the kitchen, but it knows like no, we can go this way. No reason there. And notice the time. The witching hour. 3 a.m. Some crazy ass little chains and everything. I'm guessing that's probably in the basement or something. So you've got the brick walls there. I'm not sure what it's trying to show me there. On the top, two boxes at the top, one box at the bottom, and it looks like rope. Is what we're going for. Oh, I hate this bit on the demo. I am watching you. Ooh. Watch me as much as you want. And then here comes the end of the demo, so it's all new. We got to this bit, but we don't know what it's done. Is that his, is that his door? Oh? Here, isn't it? <laughs> Oh dear Christ. We ain't gonna be following me, are ya? Are you singing? I keep thinking she's gonna be done. It doesn't mean we have to go past her. Yeah, we're gonna have to walk up to her. Oh. Pick up the courage. Right. We're coming for you. Oh, I knew it. They've still blocked this up, so you can't go that way. I can hear the chains. But what's the hammer for? Hello? Is he full of coffin? Oh dear god, it's open. So tie the Why am I doing that? Make much sense. So we just block that way. And we're blocked up in there. <coughs> we'll go that way. On that, through here. Oh, oh, Jesus Christ! Those and board the coffin up. Are we 
burn her alive. I need to find a cross put into the coffin. The only cross I knew was in here. We're performing an exorcism. Cross is gone. Where the hell did that cross go? On the bookshelf. Bookshelf in here, I'm guessing. Aha. What did that do? I don't get what I did. Did we pick up a we didn't pick up a cross then? No covered doors. open this. I thought it was in the box. Back in the kitchen. No! Oh! Oh. Jesus! Why? Something in here. I was a safe. Hi there. Do you want something? <laughs> you are creeping me out. Oh my god. <laughs> my whole arms is covered in goosebumps. You stay there. Stay. No. No. Christ my Was that just that was just a video? <laughs> oh god it's Grab the hammer. Yeah, we know that. Proof of death. Oh, 
Jesus. I mean, is it really the time to be watching a video? Oh, God. There's a rat inside it. Oh. Oh, that is grim. A rat chewing on her face. So clearly she had an affair. Somebody there? Is my imagination? Door's chained up, so. Looking for battle until death. Well, you certainly died. Oh, God, it some guy is literally there. She's there. And there's something right there. Oh my god. Jump out the window. She go out the window. Wait, there was never there was a picture there, wasn't there? Need a key. Can open this door with a bolt cutters. What do you do with a saw then? I'm gonna go downstairs. Too much creepy shit going on here. Let's board it back up again. Two nineers. Need to find the password. Uh, let me out. There's a security key code there. Free C. Is it just in this room? Or is it everywhere? Have a quick ganders about here.
Spot. Oh. All hell stand in. Too much demonic stuff in this house. Where's the hope? Ah, three B. More like walking around. The power of Christ compels you. The power of Christ compels you. Can't be that one. Is it literally is that literally? It? <laughs> See that's it's not the full code, is it? Miss letters, Jesus Christ. Breathing. Do I have to interact with these? I'm missing something. Well, thank you, kind bloody man. Boy. Is there like one more code? Maybe in his window. D. So four, three, three, five. I'm guessing. Hello? Dear Ben, I can't live like this anymore. I want to get a divorce and sell the house. My torment has become unbearable and I need freedom. Please give me the opportunity to start a new chapter in my life. Sincerely, Evelyn. You are joking me. I'll take that. Oh, I thought he was going to grab me then. <laughs> oh, God. Babies. Are you alright there, boy? You having fun? Is that him? Wait, that is some freaky. 
clever but freaky. Oh, so now I can't go downstairs. I mean, we pretty much found out what's going on. Can we just leave now? I don't want to be here anymore. Yeah, she's probably on antidepressants and many other. How many stairs does this place have? We're gonna have to look at the kids now. Hello? He was in a wheelchair. Party Island. He didn't, did he? Oh, is that in um Hey clean up? Start the key. Make me feel all better. Oh, oh well, music wasn't going on. Did she have an IV or something? What's the stand doing here? I'm going that way. Got chipped by a damn sheet. All these freaking noises going on. What the hell is? Oh, so much noise going around. I moved forward before I turned around, I was like, nah, not happening. I close the door. I am safe in the washroom. God damn it. What do I got to do with the crowbar? I'm not even sure what I got to do with the. I can't remember what I needed the crowbar for. Hi! You some crazy ass doll. Uh, no, no one's in. We have to get past it. Let's go. There's nothing on the floor. Is it in here we need the crowbar? Dear diary, mum and dad were fighting again today. If I wasn't burned, I could help them with a little Jacob. 
he requires a lot of attention and I give them a lot of trouble. It hurts me to so much to look at them and see how they suffer because of me and Jacob. If I hadn't been there, my parents would have been much happier. They won't have to worry about my health. I feel useless and unnecessary and I would like to be the best daughter for them, Alice. So something clearly happened. I've tried. Ah. Thank you. Weird doll. Okay. Why do we have the X? What? This is the boat after me now. Wondering why I need this. Oh, God. So I now have to go kill someone. Is that what you're trying to do? your turn to make the movie. What do I do? Not again. I am so confused. <laughs> Thank you, little man. Wherever you ran off to. What? Hang on, man. Why don't you keep just opening this and then... I'm going to find some bloke on the end of it with an axe to my head. Freaking noises. <laughs> okay. Do it. Oh, 
What am I doing? going on right now. Huh? Finish the movie. So they're gonna make you kill yourself. I've completed this investigation, but unfortunately I will not be able to publish it. The house is a source of madness and it has consumed me. I want to find the truth, but instead I found death. It's all about the, ma the man in the hat. It was her... Pressures his victims and makes them do terrible things. I can't resist him, Sean Miller. Dear God. Well, let's know in your chat. Wait, there's more? What? April 24th. Not a bad short of it all uh, jump scare if you want. Obviously there's not really much to do, you just follow the story. But it's not too bad. And the atmosphere is great. Many times I'm literally just sitting there most of the time having goosebumps all up my arms. I mean I felt like I was going insane with the noises and everything going on. So I'd say it was pretty good game obviously like once you've played it you know there's no replayability but for a few scares I thought it was pretty all right all right thanks for watching I'm Pro Top Jim and maybe I'll see you in the next video goodbye